Look up at the night sky. The moon hangs there familiar, constant, never far away. Now imagine something far stranger. Instead of the moon, imagine Jupiter, with its bands of orange and white, its raging storms filling half the heavens. Or Saturn, its golden rings stretching so wide they arc from horizon to horizon. Imagine walking outside at night and seeing entire worlds suspended above you, close enough to make the moon seem small. What if the planets were as close as the moon? A new sky. The sight would be breathtaking, terrifying even. Venus would rise as a glowing pearl, bright enough to cast shadows at night. Mars would loom red and immense, its canyons and volcanoes etched in stunning detail. Jupiter would dominate the heavens, its great red spot larger than Earth itself, staring back at us like a cosmic eye. Saturn's rings would turn the sky into a cathedral of light, visible even during the day. Neptune and Uranus, pale and mysterious, would hover like frozen giants painted against the stars. The night sky we know, distant points of light quiet constellations would be erased. Instead, humanity would live under the watchful gaze of giants. The illusion of beauty, but beauty has a cost. If the planets were physically as close as the moon, only 384,000 kilometers away, the universe would not allow us such a simple gift. Gravity would become our enemy. Take Jupiter. Its mass is over 300 times that of Earth. Placed at lunar distance, its gravity would tear our planet apart. Tides would rise not by meters, but by kilometers drowning continents, shattering coastlines, ripping oceans into chaos. Earth's crust itself would buckle under tidal forces, volcanoes erupting endlessly, earthquakes splitting continents like glass. Even smaller planets like Mars or Venus would warp our orbit, tugging Earth into instability. The delicate balance that keeps us circling the sun would collapse. Within centuries, or maybe just decades, Earth would drift into chaos, either plunging toward the sun or cast out into the frozen dark, a dance of destruction, and the planet planets themselves? If they all crowded into our neighborhood, their mutual gravity would pull them into collisions. Jupiter and Saturn might spiral together, shattering their moons, flinging debris across the solar system. Earth would not remain untouched. Comets, asteroids, fragments of shattered moons would rain upon us, igniting the skies with firestorms. The solar system would become a battlefield, a place where no world could remain stable. If it were just an illusion. But what if, just for a moment, we imagine a universe where the physics somehow hold, where planets could hang in the sky without ripping us apart. Then life on Earth would be transformed in other ways. Human culture would be forever shaped by these celestial neighbors. Myths, religions, and philosophies would not look upward to distant, mysterious dots of light. They would grow under the gaze of giant worlds filling the heavens. Jupiter might be worshipped as a god, its storms seen as omens. Saturn's rings might inspire art, architecture, and stories for millennia. Exploration would come faster. Seeing Mars so close, so tangible, would ignite humanity's urge to cross the void. Planets would not feel distant. They would feel like neighbors just waiting to be visited. The final thought. So what if planets were as close as the moon in the night sky? The sight would be magnificent. Worlds so vast and beautiful that they would make the moon seem tiny. But the reality of physics would turn beauty into destruction. Gravity would tear Earth apart. The solar system collapsing into chaos. Unless, of course, it were only an illusion. An alternate universe where worlds could stand beside us without harm. In that strange universe, Humanity would grow under skies of endless wonder, our destinies shaped not by a single moon, but by the watchful eyes of a thousand giants. A sky of beauty, a sky of terror, a sky where the universe itself feels close enough to touch.